we got a little rain. <laughs> and that's where I want to get. But there's no sense in it now. Everything will blow off the shovel before I get a chance to get it to the gold town. So I'm back at the uh, the dig we were digging in here and cleared out this whole area. And while I was gone, in spite of all the instructions I gave, everything got screwed up down here. I had a perfect dropout zone set up over there for this spring because it's it's said that we're going to get a pretty harsh winter. Who knows? Time will tell. But you know, prepare. So I had a nice dam that was reinforced as long as anybody didn't move rocks it would have stayed in place until next spring I come back after 15 days to come down here and get my head clear and I didn't get my head clear because I had a lot of work to do before I could even start digging and I wasn't too happy about it I instructed that you don't eject tailings into the hole tailings were ejected into the hole I instructed when you're digging, as you're digging, you move rocks. And don't throw rocks where people are going to be digging. I come back and there's a pile of rocks everywhere. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not too happy. There was another dam built here. Uh, just a bunch of rocks. Just rocks, rocks. Everything's screwed up. But anyway, no more Mr. Nice Guy. Uh, I'm just I'm just not going to be a nice guy anymore. I mean, well, you know what I mean. To you guys, I will be. But as far as when people show up and I want to be nice and try to teach them stuff, and I say, well, come on and join us, and that translates into come down here and mess it up. But anyway, I'm just not going to do that anymore. So today, I'm going to dig right over in here in this area. I've got the gold trap set up right there where the sun is and we'll see what we can get and you might want to stick around in this video because at some point in this video I'm going to be giving instructions that you're not going to want to miss if you're a public subscriber so stay tuned I'm going to start digging and hopefully get some gold down here all right so I just did a test pan There's thirteen pieces. Probably not gonna be able to see them. I, I forgot to bring my focus stone down, but biggest one is about fifty plus mesh. Um, one pan, right where my shovel is right now. So, time to get digging.
Look who showed up. Coming down the hard way. That's funny. <laughs> All right, so seeing how Hung showed up, I put the bucket on the uh, end of the skid plate. I'm going to go ahead and do a clean out. And I have not been digging that long. Not at all. Maybe 20 minutes, if that. So let's see what I do. And like I said, the focus stone's up in the van, so I don't know. But we'll do what we can. Back in a bit. All right, I got it panned back. Let's see how this stone does. There we go. Like I said, that's maybe maybe 20 minutes. I don't even think I was digging that long. Plus the 15 pieces I found in the first pan which are in the bucket. So, I'm gonna have some lunch, then I'm gonna keep digging. I'll let you know what I get at the end of the day. Got a really technique, a good technique in panning. I like that. But she goes through it pretty quick. Yeah. All the heavies are still right there. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. And you said the reason why you do it that way is why? Well, I do the rice. The rice in Vietnam. Yeah. Well, you can get your feet. You do it that way too. Huh. All right, everybody. So, as you know, I got to 1,000 subscribers. And I promised everybody that I was going to be doing a giveaway of one of the 23-inch Pace Street Finders, the next generation made out of polycarbonate. So. This is the video, and my favorite gold prospector partner is with me today, and she's going to tell you what you got to do. What do they got to do, Hung? Leave a comment. Leave a comment. <laughs> and of course, you've got to be a public subscriber. If your subscriptions are set to private, I don't know if you're a subscriber, so make sure you're a public subscriber. I do have a video. It's going to be way back. If you click on videos, the link on the YouTube channel videos and scroll down there's a video showing you how to do that with Google so good luck everybody and uh, we're gonna do a clean out here and probably wrap it up for the day so we'll catch you in a bit and good luck take care now check this out hung just panning today <laughs> Look at all the gold in her pan. <laughs> That's awesome. Good for you, Hung. <laughs> all right, so as you know, I dug over there. I did some up in that corner up there. I really wanted to get up there. I told you that earlier. So maybe tomorrow the water level will be down. I can get up in there. Um, but I dug on this side of the dam over here in the corner up against the bedrock. Only got nine pieces up there. So then I came back down here, and on the other side of this dam, I dug over in here. Hung's been nailing it over through here, and there's a hole, I think, right behind her that she's been getting all her gold out of. So, And I knew this whole line of rocks down through here was going to be good, and I was right. So, as I said, I'm going to go ahead and do a clean out. See what we get at the end of the day. Back in a bit.
that's everything for the day. I'm pretty happy with that. Not too bad at all. Wished I didn't waste time up on that other spot where I only got nine pieces. If I stayed down here, it would have been much better. All right, everybody. So, can't wait till next season when the water warms back up because I'm really itching to get back in the water. <laughs> Hung asked me today, are you going in the water? I'm like, uh, no. <laughs> not today, not till next year. So, all right, everybody. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave your comment for the giveaway. Like, share, and subscribe and I've said it before I'll say it again if you don't win don't give up stay subscribed because I will be doing more in the future take care everybody